Welcome to the I Spy Queen channel. My name is Anitra and I'm a full-time reseller. I do a lot of different things on my channel from source videos, unbagging, unjarring, craft videos, just a lot of different things. So if you run across this channel and you like what you see, think about subscribing. It's free. It doesn't cost a thing. I would love to have you. Welcome everybody to $2 Tuesday, where everything you're going to see is going to be $2 each piece. Please put your time stamp in the comment for the items or items that you may be interested in. And the first one who does that will be awarded the items. And please check in the comments, there will be a pinned sold list of what has been sold so you don't have to search through and look at something and it's maybe not available. So yeah. First, um, we have this stretchy silver tone bracelet with faux pearl beads. And I do believe these are plastic, but this can pretty much fit anybody. You can even probably put this on your ankle as an ankle bracelet so you can cha-cha-cha-cha-cha. So we have that. That is $2. Next, we have this stretchy bracelet pretty colors this one as well you might be able to put it on your ankle as well the stretch is good on it like the amber color beads we have that next we have this bag of thank you cards with rings i guess this might have been for a wedding or something to that effect but a whole bunch of uh metal rings with thank yous with the holes already punched into them we have that next we have this paris tower and it sits like that it said paris paris we have that next we have this little lot we have these uh colored um rhinestones uh you can put these on anything then we have this um butterfly and it's hard i do believe these are for like putting on um sheets or napkins or pillows or different things like that so we have those so you get three items for two dollars next we have this little lot of pens shirt pens um we have a angel here and a cross and a cancer i believe this is a avon yes i was right yeah so we have that so two dollars for the three How's everybody doing today? Hopefully good. I will be live at 6.45 Eastern today. You guys, if you want to stop by and say hello or stop by and see what I got. Um, this says Express. It's a double layered wearable inch on this one is. And it has an extender. This one is a 13 wearable inch gunmetal tone lobster claw clasp. Oh, they got these pretty little whitish moon glowish kind of purplish like beads, y'all. Disco ball beads, too. So we have that. Next, we have this. Uh, I want to say, I call it a cameo piece. Um, you can put your own design in there. And it's a pendant. So we have that. $2. That's heavy too, you guys. Heavy. Now I went to try to go get my nails done. The place was closed because that came off. And that's coming off a little bit. So I'm a little upset. But we're going to get it together. 
we're gonna get it together. Next, we have this silver tone bracelet with marcasites kind of beads. It's a stretchy. Um, eventually, at some point, the stretch might need to um, be replaced, but it's a good looking bracelet. Good looking bracelet. Be, to be honest, you guys, I can't stand stretch braces because they be beautiful. And then if it breaks, it's going to break all over the place. But to each their own that makes them, I'm not knocking it. I just don't care for it. Next we have, these are hard plastic. Spring Wing Class, white and black. Uh, wearable inch on this is an 11. Wearable inch, 11. Next we have, I do believe this is an ankle bracelet. Very pretty. Or it's a bracelet, one of the two. I know it's got three different, yeah, I would say an ankle. It's pretty though. It's got three different loops for the sizes on it. Whoever did this did a beautiful job. That's a lot of patience to get all those beads on there. We have that. Next we have this um, locket. It's got a letter B on it. Here's the inside. This needs to wipe down. You guys, I don't clean the jewelry until I sell it. All right. But it's, when it comes to your door, it will be clean. So B for Beth. I mean B for Beth. <laughs> B for whoever name is B. <laughs> Beth, you must be on my mind, girl. <laughs> B for Beth. <laughs> All right. Next, we have a wooden bracelet. Stretch is good on this. Next, we have this rosary. It's wooden. Um, so we have. I definitely do want to get into. I gotta count the beasts. I want to get into uh, making rosaries. I believe I can make some pretty ones. So be on the lookout for that, y'all, because I am going to master how to do it. Yes, I am. Next, we have this antique gold tone. Um, Multi-layer necklace. You got, you hook it there. Wearable on it. Um, I would say seven, maybe. It's like a choker. No maker's mark here. And this is the hook here. I always call these um dog chain beads, but I think it's a word for the necklace ball necklace i think it's called so we have that next we have this puffy faux pearl necklace with um gunmetal tones and it's got two pink beads on the sides wearable um, this is a eight and fully extended, probably get a 10 out of it, but I like how it's set up. Here's the two, they like a peachy pink. Oh, where's the other one? Right there. So we have that long extender. Next, we have a set of two handkerchiefs. We have this one. No stains that I see on there. And we have this white one. No stains I see on this one as well. 
It's got the pretty little embroidery. I like the feel of these. So two for two dollars. So it's like a dollar each. So you have that. Two of those two. Next we have this set of two. No stains I see or pulls or rips on this one. And we have this one. I like the colors on that. This one looks like it's got a little bit of a discoloration. If you can see. But no rips or pulls. Two dollars. Next we have this little Minnie Mouse washable change purse. Here's the inside. These are good. Um, you're going out really fast because you can actually fold them. Things like this, honestly, and I'm not trying to be funny. I like to stick them in my bra if I don't have pockets. You know, just throw a card and some cash and my ID and fold it up and throw it in my bra or my back pocket. Well, I don't if I don't have pockets, yeah. But yeah, we got that and it's washable. Two dollars. Next, we have this uh, scarf. Um, no pulls. I think it's got a little, little right there, a little pull there. Maybe a little one right there, kind of like. It's good you go over things again because there's some things I don't see. And I try to be as honest as I can about what I see. We have that. Um, I don't believe it's a tag on these. Some of them do. And I will do the uh, width of across it. Let's across and then the inches down. Um, it is, I do believe, 12 inches. 57 inches down. And it did have a tag, but it's nothing on there. So, yeah. $2. Next, we have this. I want to believe it's a money clip, maybe. Or either you just clip it to your pants. But it is a little nail file on that end. And a little knife on that end. I do believe this is vintage. So we have that. What do it say? Oh, it's got a mark in here. Let's see what it says. It is... um stainless and it's got a little crown up above us we have that next we have this white puffy necklace um it has an extender it is um a nine wearable inch on that Pretty puffy white. Next, we have this vintage um, half curtain. Be nice for a country house. I thought it was a vintage oven cover. I mean, uh, toaster cover. That's what I thought it was when I got it. Uh, 100%. Ooh, made in India. Okay, focus. There we go. Um, 
yeah i thought it was a uh <laughs> a vintage um toaster cover so let's get an inch on how long it is actually it's 52 and some change long that's what it is but yeah I, I thought it was pretty cool you know you watch some of those older movies and you see things so i thought it was like oh it's a toaster cover but no it's a half curtain i forgot the proper name of it y'all so put it in the comment please and thank you so we have that next we have a set of four placemats holiday ones they got uh look like they got bowls on them so you got one two three four nice thick ones no stains or or rips or tears. I was looking to see if one of them had a tag so we could see what the maker was, but no, unfortunately, no. So we have those. Next, we have this vintage picture of a little girl in the rain. Here's the back, it's wooden. So we have that. Next, we have this needlewin work. I don't know what this is exactly, but here's the inches and in centimeters of what it's in red. So we have that. Next, we have this uh, Disney princess. I don't know if all the pieces are there. Um, I was assured that they was all there. It's got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven mermaids. I guess that would how it was look. It's supposed to be 300 pieces in here. So yeah, two dollars. Next we have this coffee mug. I'm never not thinking of your butt. It looks to be new. Here's the bottom. Comes in its own box. Its own box. So two dollars. Next we have this brooch. It's got a bow on it. Um, I don't know if you guys remember these Walmart and um, the JC Penney's photos used to do these. Put your picture in there. It's got the plastic in there. You just would pop something in there to take it out. But yeah, two dollars. Next we have this uh, gold tone and enameled earrings. Here's the back post. They are not marked. Next, we have this pendant. It's like a cabochon. It's not real, I do not believe. Silver tone chain, lobster claw clasp. Wearable inch on this one is uh, a 10. 10 wearable inch on that. Next, we have a set of two. These are for men, I do believe, to go in the pockets of their suit jackets. Like a silkish material. Y'all know I make up my own words. <laughs> so we have that one. No stains or cuts or snags. On this one. Next we have the brown one. Again, no rips or pulls on that one. I don't know if these, they could be handkerchiefs. I don't know. So $2. Next we have this little lavender cross. 
crocheted. Whoever did it did an excellent job. So we have that. Next, we have this grandma brooch. I do believe this is I Love You. It's porcelain. Here's the back. Next, we have these enameled red and green earrings and black post. Next, we have this vintage uh, um, coral necklace. It has a little wear in between the little ringlets. Um, it's a choker style. Um, for its year, it's honestly in an excellent condition other than the wear. Um, wearable inch on this is um, 8 inches. Yeah, but if you had one of these little pins and it's this other uh, stuff I use, you can touch it up in between the little crevices. I mean, I would do it, but I honestly don't have time to do it. But yeah, so like right in there. But yeah, $2 for this vintage coral. Coral. Next, we have another cameo style piece. Vintage hook. Um, you put whatever you would want in there, and then you got your own brooch. So we got that. Next, we have these sparkly gold tone glitter style post earrings. Here's the back. I do believe I do believe that is uh, the maker mark for uh, I forget. <laughs> so if you know what it is, it's like little uh a square box with little circles almost so we have those next we have this stretchy silver tone ring anybody could wear it it's a stretch and next we have this ring pretty lavender colors silver tone i did touch this up with the pen because it had a little wear on it. But it is a seven some change. So yeah, I touched it up with the pen. So we have that. And last but not least, we have this guest wallet. Um, it has a little teeny strip wear up there. All the rhinestones are there. Here's the inside. It's got an inside pocket here. Inside pocket there for your checkbook. Um, it's got a little wear there. And there. But it's not a big noticeable thing. Here's the back. It's got a little discoloration there. Uh, zipper pocket. It's a feather in there. A feather. <laughs> feather. Okay. So $2 for it. And it's got the guest back here. And that is it, you guys. Again, if you are not interested in anything, please leave a comment for your favorite um, items out of this video. And again, I will be back on at 645 Eastern with a live $2 start bid auction. Um, yeah, come and say hello. Check me out. Maybe it's my, and I have different variety of things for that particular sale. So again, come and check me out. And if you run across this channel, please think about subscribing. It's free. It does not cost a thing. I would surely love to have you. And until then, you guys, please um, stay safe and stay blessed. Stay kind and courteous to each other because some of us might need a friend or someone to talk to. 
You know, we all are different. God made us that way for a reason. So again, um, please stay safe, stay blessed. Stay kind and courteous to one another. And always remember to check on your friends, family, and neighbors. And please remember to always keep it real. Be yourself. Don't let no one change you because God made you the way he wanted to make you. Until then, y'all, I spy Queen Anitra, y'all. I'm out. Bye-bye.